coming clean with Val G and Jeffrey G about to come clean also. No, he's not. He's not weighing himself. I don't know why. I'm weighing myself and I weigh this morning 187. So it's that kind of like little bouncing around because I cannot do the strict no sugar, no bread stuff. I just can't. Tried it. It doesn't work. So I'm enjoying myself. I'm eating pretty much really well most of the time. I do have that uh, purple carrot thing going on. So I've got three purple carrot vegan meals that I will be making over this weekend. Really looking forward to that. <laughs> They're really nice, those meals. Yes, I love them. And they're finished. Very good. Oh, God. So, so um, <clears throat> we saw a great movie today with Emma Thompson. Is that it, Thompson or Thomas? Yes, it's yeah. not Thompson, I think. Anyway. Um, Look at this hair. It's gone completely. Can't do a thing with it. <laughs> Look. It's like a bloody wig. Well, you have to put products on it. I know, I know. Why? Do you want to put products on <laughs> 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 do you no the only thing is you look a bit like you look a bit My like mother. your mom when it's like a bouffant you know because hers were right but um <laughs> what are you doing you got to have long hair to have it flowing behind your ears and mm -hmm. things uh, hi Ida hi Mark so um Mark Prioletti, good God. <laughs> like, How are you doing, Mark Prioletti? Yes, let us know in the comments. How amazing is that? Retired. Who? Ma many years now, Mark. Oh, yes. Yeah. Fantastic. My gosh, we... That's... Motorola was our f first client. First client back basically. in 1985. My 1985. 1985. Yes. It's actually, I'm a bit chilly here, but never mind. Well, I just thought it was a different backdrop with the trees and everything. And oh, a right. A little bit of your sailing boat. My sailing boat. Yes. My several sailing boats. We used to go sailing quite a lot, you know. Yes, when we had money. We crewed. <laughs> we used to be the crew. And the we crew. Crew from Waukegan to Chicago. And do you remember that one time when we were crewing along, sailing along, this, and the sun was shining, and suddenly behind us this huge black cloud and it followed us, and then we were like literally in a storm. Yes. And then that other boat came along, and it kind of rounded out in front of us. I thought we were all going to die. Yeah, thank God for that. Um, the captain managed to just pull out at the right moment, yes. and we missed everything. Gosh. We could have died. In Lake Michigan. In Lake Michigan. Because it does. Those storms come up really fast. A little bit like life in a way, isn't it? Coming up really, yes. <laughs> the, you know, end, the end of life is coming up really fast. No, no, I life. wasn't talking about that. Right. I wasn't being that dramatic. Right. No, I was just talking about, you know, how you, you're going along, it's all great, and then the boiler breaks or the, I don't know, the vacuum breaks. You know, small stuff like that that just kind of like, oh, God. Oh, I'm there's somebody in the bottom of the boat drilling a hole. Right. Right. Dirty. And I won't say who that is. I'm not drilling any holes. I don't know if you know that I can see, see you. I right. mean, it's funny if, you know, if like we're facing, oh, I don't know. It's never funny, actually. Life so, lifing. Um, I'm doing really well. Um, I still haven't quite got this, this eating thing. I, I'm still struggling with it. So today we went to a Japanese <laughs> restaurant and I had a bento box. A bento box. And uh, it came with the miso, miso soup, me, 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 which was lovely. Right. And uh, six little uh, California rolls. Wow. And chicken and some, uh, I don't know, those vegetables in tempura, I think it is, right? And, uh, so I'd, I ate the soup, da 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 da. And then I thought, you know what? I am not hungry anymore. But we were sitting there and sitting there, and I just, I just ate it all in the end, except for the rice. And then we mm. also had some sake, which was very nice. Which is very nice, yes. So I don't know how to eat like a thin person. I, I'm just struggling with it because 
because you don't have the mind of a thin person. See, I don't. I don't have the mind of a thin person. Right. Well, I know. Because you. a thin per Oh, thank you. <laughs> because a thin person doesn't think about what we think about. If we're having a happy day, we eat. If we're having an unhappy day, we eat. I know. Very emotional. Food is like <gasps> the textures, the smell, the feel, having a glass of wine. Everything is wonderful. Yes, Edith says life lighting. I know. I and Mark said, that. Oh, you did. Sorry, I, was, never mind. I wasn't listening to you. <laughs> <laughs> I haven't heard a word you said. No. <laughs> I, yeah, as usual. Yes. I listen to your every word. I you hang. hang on my every word. Yes, I do. Not. So, where yes. are you now then? 187. 187. Yeah. And uh, I mean, really, it's not that much if I want to get down to. Well, if to you were one... seven foot, it would be fun. Oh, shut up. <laughs> <laughs> yes, if you were 14 foot, it would be great. <laughs> no, it's not that much. 47 pounds to get down to my goal of 140. And which... you're doing it a pound kind of... Do, 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 yeah, it's going up, up and down. Pound, pound, yes, pound yes. up, pound down. And right. I'm not getting depressed about it. Well, sometimes I do a little bit. Right. I well, have to admit, sometimes I'm like, oh, God. Everybody gets depressed a little bit. And the other thing... Or, right. Yes, go on. What, what? Go on, say speak now the happiest you've ever been i am the happiest i've ever been right um even when i'm not that happy very good but i was looking at you know sometimes uh, so i'm trying to put these videos onto youtube and i don't know how to do that and it's that's kind of frustrating but also i'm watching us doing these and i'm thinking why are we doing them they're so you know, two old people. Two old fat people. Two trying old to be fat thin. people trying to be thin that, and happy. Right. Right. Okay. And then, as we were going along our day to day, um, there was something that we were talking about that I said, we must talk about that tonight. And now I can't remember what it is. Right. <laughs> it well, would again, have been really interesting for you. So I'm so sorry thing. that we, we can't get, remember. Yes, we can't. It was a life changing something Absolutely. that would have. And in fact, if we remember and tell it, it could have changed oh, you know your what? life. I know what, what was it was. It? it was about married people um, that they have the same argument year in, year out. Uh. And. It's not the fact that you have the same argument, but it's the fact that you n we need to talk about it. Do you remember that? Yes, it's called an insoluble problem. Wow. Oh. Or tell us more, Mr. G. I'm <laughs> again hanging on your every word. Don't be rude. Go on. Very hurtful. An insoluble problem. Yes, that's yes. what this guy came up with. Okay. 67% of marriages there are situations and areas that are insoluble. You can't solve them. So what you have to do over the years is to communicate better about it. Right. You're not going to solve it because it's insoluble. Right. Insoluble. Is that something to do with the chemistry thing that you put something in? I and think it's so, soluble. but you do like that insolvable. word. Unsolvable. Unsolvable. Oh, for the love of God, I don't know. <laughs> Um, anyway, so what you have to do is we have to communicate, communicate, not get angry and upset, but to be able to communicate as quickly as possible. So what is the thing that you hate about me? Everything. Thank you. <laughs> no, um, oh God, I can't remember what it is now. So, I mean, it can't be that bad. Um, I'm sure it is. Well, it's it's kind of you know I fell in love with you because you're so funny, and, and sometimes it's like oh I'm my funny. god, right. could you just be serious a little bit? Never. Which is also what I love about you, because if I was married to someone like me, it would be so serious, and you know, hello, are we going <laughs> vegan today? Yes, my dear, we will go vegan today. Okay, then you buy the carrots and I'll buy the beetroot. All right, my darling, let's go out and do that right now. That was very frightening. <laughs> I know. I don't know who that were you channeling somebody there. My father. Oh, your father. <laughs> Dear God, rest his soul. Anyway, Very good. it would be like that. Well, we're eating the purple carrot, aren't we? <laughs> Beg your pardon. There is such a vegetable as a purple carrot, but it's not that the purple carrot is the company that supplies the food vegan that we then have to chop and scrape and yes. wash and cook and do everything. Um. 
Marge says, love you too, funny, funny. Yes. We try to be, because if we if it's not Stop funny, it's... All oh, right, okay. Upper hair. Upper hair. Don't upper, do the accent either. It's upper not hair. That right, okay. Good. That's the thing I don't like about you, but we'll talk about it later. What, we'll my, my accents? It. Yes. I love my accents. I can start off Irish and end up Scottish and or Welsh. Which is about the same. Ah, to be sure there. <laughs> it goes on like that and then it ends up... Oh, oh no, it could God. end up right. anyway. Stop, right. babe. I love that. See sense, what though. happens when you drink sake? Yes. I think now I... you could become Japanese. No. No, that's... you can't do that because no. that would be personally insulting. No. Yes. Basically incorrect. Right. right. I can do Irish, Scottish, English, or Welsh because I am one of those. Ha. And a little bit of French, as you know, my ancestry, French oh, Huguenots. God. How often do we have to hear that? What, is there something special about being a French Huguenot? I think Not so. that I'm aware of. I think so, because we had... Weren't um, they the ragtag and bobtail, the gypsies of France? No, no, we were the crash Shoved over people. to England to keep away. That's why I ended up in Manchester, because the French Huguenots went there to um, because of the mill damp. the cotton. Because or of the you... damp weather. Right. Very good. Exactly. And most of them died of pneumonia. Where did you come from, Mr. Viking? There you go, a Viking. That you thought you were from Ireland all these years. Right. <laughs> discovered. No. No. That's why you've got short, fat, hairy legs. Right, because you had Vikings have got short, tree trunk <laughs> legs. Row over the seas. To wield the axe and to row the oar. Right. But anyway, I, I don't know what it, this has got to do with losing weight. It's got everything to do with losing weight. Losing weight. I used to hate losing weight, like with, with the diet companies i'm not going to rag on them because i think they do a great job for many people but not for me i just couldn't stand that weekly weigh-in of like oh you know and i'd be taking my jewelry out my glasses could come off and you know i'd go in my very you most... would go in your dressing gown with nothing underneath <laughs> no, I, wouldn't, but I would off just... with your dressing gown it used to frighten people away at weight watchers they would run like hell mop, mop, mop. <laughs> um, no, but I would wear my lightest clothing. Of course. And then it would be, uh, you know, oh, you put on 0.5 of a pound. And it would be like, oh, God, you know. Then I'd have to sit through the uh, conversation or the, the little lecture thing. But the good news was there was always people huger than us. True. So it made us feel slightly sanctimonious. Yes. And what's the other word? The German word? Schodenfrauden. Schod there's a little Schodenfrauden came in to say, thank God I'm not like that. Right. But then there's thin people looking at us and going, kill them now. No, the thing is, though, it's the lifers that I kind of like, you know, I, I used to sit there thinking, do I really want to come here for the rest of my life? No. So that's a problem in a way. I mean, I really do want to be down to 140 pounds. But is it important enough? As one of my Facebook friends wrote, you know, what do you really want? Well, I do want to lose... What do you lose, really, really want? I do want to lose weight, and I, I want to enjoy my life, which is food. Glorious food. I love food. <laughs> Don't do the accent, I'll tell you. I love the food. I think I can oh, do now we're doing German. a little German tour because... Uh, I think that's politically incorrect. No, I have some German in my background. So no, you don't. I'm so sure I do. It. Everybody in Europe has everybody's background. For goodness sake, we were... Yes, mongrels. One we're all mongrels. continent, weren't yes. we, at one time? That's why we're so nuts. Yes. Anyway. Um... Back to losing weight. <laughs> yes. It's not happening. No, it is. It's kind of, you're going, you started off up there, you came down, went up a bit, 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 came down, went up a bit. Exactly. So now you're doing, you're lying around here. 187. And you need to be down there. Yes. But you're, you're about there. Right. And tomorrow we're going out, we're meeting people for lunch, lunch. at the Greek Island restaurant. So how's that Excellent. going to be? I'm definitely going to have a glass well, of what wine can you or eat? something. Why? Because I want to. And there also, I read it's good for you to have a glass of wine every day. Really? The, the Queen think, Mother had a gin and tonic every day or something. Yes, but I think when, you know, when they say glass, it doesn't mean bottle. No, <laughs> you're so funny, Mr. J. Why do you keep doing those I don't accents? Know. <laughs> Stop. Uh, People like... know me, it's embarrassing. Um, yes. What else? 
I don't know, a Greek restaurant. I'm going to oh, have... Re now, uh, what can you eat in the Greek restaurant that's very um, diet-proof? Not that umpa cheese umpa. thing. You know that cheese... <laughs> Stick it up your jumper. You know that cheese umpa. thing that they umpa. come and... Umpa! And there's cheese flaming. I don't think, I don't yeah. think they say umpa, do they? Something like that. Anyway, if anybody knows what they say, please type it in for us. <laughs> what do the Greeks say with the flaming cheese and... It's... Um, Oy vey! No, no, that's, that's Jewish. And again, that's politically incorrect. Well, everything um, these days. I don't know what I can have there. There's lamb. Oh, good. Love lamb. I think lamb. I might have some lamb. Of course, it's not very vegan. Yeah, oh, it's very God. vegan. See, I wish I hadn't thought of that now. Upa. So upa. See, it is upa. I was just saying umpa. Opa. Oh, oh yeah. never mind. Anyway, who cares? Oh, that's right. So, okay. well, we'll have a wonderful time yes. eating lamb. And I will enjoy the conversation. Uzo. I could have a little Uzo. Ah. Ooh, Uzo and a coffee. Uzo, a coffee, and, um, and um, some vegetables. Uzo, wait a minute. How do I get my hand up there, down there? How do I control my hand movements? <laughs> Where do you want your hand? Wait a minute. Let me do. Watch out. Yeah. You're a little bit too close there, too aren't close. you? There. <laughs> no. Um, yeah, so you're basically just going to drink with some vegetables. Yes. I'm not going to drink with vegetables. Yeah, but, but when you drink, what happens? Oh, yeah, that's the problem. You go berserk. I want sugar then. So right, then I so, want Dunkin' Donuts. So yes. you're saying I shouldn't have a drink? How many times? Midnight, one o'clock, drunk as skunks. We've had to go to... That was Dunkin years Donuts. ago. Let's yeah, just say that was that years was... ago. It was about four days ago. It's years ago. But we won't talk about that because we're on a diet. Right. So I'll have one Boston drink. Boston cream pie. No, I'm going to have one drink and I'm going to have vegetables and that's it. Maybe some soup. Right. Okay. What are you having? I honestly don't know. What's it? Uh, I don't like cheese so much, so that doesn't really, you know. What's a good the thing? The lamb. I'll have the lamb. What's a good thing to have in a Greek restaurant? Any ideas, Any ladies ideas? and gentlemen? What's good? Greek restaurant. Fish. Fish. Fish, you silly boy. Yes. Of course. That's great. Okay. Right. So Not gonna... tilapia, though. Why? It's a bottom dweller. Ah. Right. You don't want bottom dwellers. I thought you we were. You don't want to be eating bottom dwellers. We're a couple of bottom dwellers, well, we are. so we might be all but right. Hopefully nobody tilapia. wants to eat us. Okay. Chicken. Chicken? Yeah. Yeah. Chicken fish. I'm going to do the fish because it feels a little bit more. It's nowhere near vegan, but just feels. You're a pescatorian. Yes. Oh, I love that word. Pescatorian. Don't step in the pescatorian. It takes hours to get it off. That was funny. No, I'm good. All right, everybody. Um, well, how long have we been on? Oh. Seems like a lifetime. 18 minutes. Good God. You're supposed to fly. be on at least 10 so people can find you. But any more than that, I think, gets a bit laborious and people are thinking, God, I wish they'd stop so I can click off and, you know, that kind of thing. Yes. What does this say? Um, Tamasa. Oh, yes. Oh, Tamasalata. Yes. Love it. Fish For roll. appetizer. I love that. Yes. We were in Greece, uh, in Corfu years ago, sitting in a little side street with coffee and ouzo and Tamasalata. Fantastic. And that was eight in the morning. Mwah, you should have mwah. seen us by lunchtime. <laughs> All right. Well, All right. and on that happy Stop. high note, what? Well, wait a minute. Have oh. we said everything? Oh. We've got to get to at least 20 minutes, haven't we? So the experts told us we've got a minute left. Right. What's your secret to happiness then? Um, being with you, my treasure. That was the right answer. Um, what else? Uh, just do not take life seriously. Right. You've only got one of them. Yes. You might as well live it to the fullest. Excellent. Do whatever you need to do whenever you need to do it without hurting anybody. Very good. As long as you're not hurting anybody, go for it. That's Take risks. Do wonderful things. In yoga, that's called ahimsa, nonviolence. You do, and I'll rub your nose in it. I, I don't have anything else to say, so I'm kind of like... You just sort of stop, don't you? It's like a battery. You just go, but that's it now. <laughs> I've got nothing left to say. Well, I think it's just rambling at this point, so, you know. 
Yes, well, oh, and don't forget to share this with as many people as you possibly can. We're trying to get to at least six people. <laughs> <laughs> oh, my God. No, we, how many did we have that were on it yesterday? That I don't know, but listen. Are you told us 70 something? I know, I can't remember. Anyway, anyway um, next time we need to have the laptop higher so that we're looking up so that my double chin isn't like that. Yeah. You could do it like that, couldn't you? Okay. Let's it looks see. a little strange. Oh, that. Okay. Okay. It's the fact is we're porkers, babe. Right. Everybody knows it. We have to look the best we can. Jeremy's on. Hi guys. Hi. Hey. Jeremy, I was just talking about you yesterday. Very bad. You're saying Seriously. very bad. No, things. I was saying like Jeremy, and you know how is he doing? And yes, yes. where is he? Where are you? And here you are. It's there nice we go. To see you. Hope everything's going in well in the IT world. Ah, the dreaded IT. Did, that's it. I was thinking, I wonder if you finished that course that you were doing at, uh, I don't know, Washington University or something. You were doing an online Masters, course. Masters, wasn't it, or something? Something big, yeah. Something very intelligent. Something way bigger than what we're doing, but anyway. Uh, it says, uh, that looks great. The angle doesn't help, Jeff, though. <laughs> <laughs> oh, now how do we do the, how do no, I? No, no, you're not. No, you do... can't oh, do that. Oh, yes, yes. Stopped, right. The dreaded finger was oh, nearly yes. came out. <laughs> but life goes on. Listen, we're into 21 minutes now, so say goodbye right now and cancel the whole thing. Okay. Well, no, don't, oh. because there's other people. Oh, Stephen right, Henry, okay. who's he? Um, it's Stephen. Ste oh, Stephen. Yes. Never heard of him. Oh, oh stop. Right. But now he's just joined, so he won't know. So you can go back and look at it later. All right. Well, I don't know. Is that right? I will tell Stephen that I am at 187 pounds, started out at 205. So even though you can see my fat little face now, it was a lot fatter then in January. And um, it will dwindle down as the days and weeks go by. And um, by the end of it, I'll be quite skeletal. -tal. I doubt that, babe. You've never really been skeletal. And I wouldn't know what to do with you if you were Oh, let's not get into that. Slim and you know, thin. I am considering, just yes. FYI, doing a coming clean after hours, which will be an adult talk about all kinds of things that young people cannot hear. I'll How let you, I'll let you people, know about that. Anybody under 30 shouldn't listen to this. Right. Yes, because it'll be disgusting. And I'm not sure what time Old to do Old people having like, sex is not funny. Maybe 12 o'clock at night, something like that. Right, and we just have our heads because we'll be completely nude. No, I'm underneath. not. No? <laughs> no, but I thought that it would be fun to, talk, to have an after hours because we have been married 50 years, so there's a lot of expertise that we can share with people, save you all the problems that people have in uh, marriages. And things. Yes. Right. All the different positions and all of those kind exactly. of things. Exactly. Okay. The Taiwan Apparently basket. there's only six. No, there's ten. Oh, okay. But we can only, now we can manage about two. That's for the after hours Oh, program. that's for the after hours. Okay. okay. Very good. All right. Love you all, my Facebook friends. Thank you so much for joining because it's because of you that I didn't have the pie or the chocolate or the cake that I could have had if I was not going to be coming clean right today. and as soon as we finish this we're straight into the chocolate and the pies <laughs> with heavy i'm drinking. gonna go clean my teeth now and ah. floss, clean and floss and i can't have anything else to eat maybe a cup of tea that's it very good very good okay it's 23 minutes now 24 minutes good lord i don't think you should be saying how long it is because then... just remember to share this for the love of god please share this so we get a huge audience and become famous just before we die. Okay, love you all. Thank you so much. Goodbye. Goodbye.